Growing up in Brooklyn itself is very inspiring. Though we didn't come from much, the neighborhood, the sense of community and family on my one little block was a world in its own. And like a neighborhood hero, graffiti artist, came by and seen that I had some talent, and he gave me my name. I transformed that day from just being Michael McClear to being, you know, Caves. But I was always one that had it in my head and I would create. As a child, there was all this, this celebration and excitement and that started to become my inspiration. I could create a painting in a few hours just by expression uh, and adrenaline and then boom, give me paint. It could be house paint, it could be, it could be uh, markers, it could be spray paint and I, and I can create something. There's a lot of different mediums that I work in. I was always a storyteller as a child as well. So we always communicated with stories and, and with our music as well. So to tell these stories, you didn't have to be, um, one medium doesn't have to be your thing. There's no rules when it comes to expression. It's, it's really opening up your mouth or opening up or your mind and, and uh, making a mark. Expression could be any, any part of the day. It could be, done musically, it could be done, you know, by creating art. And I'm living in the, in, in, in the moment and celebrating, you know, uh, an expression that, that, that's always continuing uh, evolving, you know, and, um, and, and I think that's what it's all about. I remember when I was young, growing up as a birth of bum, so I'm giving us away, is anybody going my way? I'ma bring you back to the old day, when we were young, not long ago, when we heard you rocking on the radio, girls doing the way of was simple, only thing that you need to know is just close your eyes, man, hold your breath, coming in, coming back to begin to step, hit the road, one more time, here we go, so pour the wine.